slide. Ain't going back to pump with you. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel, guys. It's Robert here, YouTube on the budget. Uh, man, it's been a long night, man. It's been raining like crazy. It doesn't seem like it now, but it's a lot of traffic, guys. Everybody, I guess, is late. Um, I couldn't sleep, man. My dog was whining because of the freaking the thunder, a little crybaby. Um, yeah, but this video, guys, is talking about why I picked, why am I going with a lifted truck um, versus other styles of truck. Now, it's totally a lot of different styles uh, when you want to pick a truck build. Um, if I wouldn't go lift it, I probably would have wouldn't drop like 18s or 20s or like the speed type of truck or I would have went like um, probably bag tubbed out with intro rails and all that. Um, so, what's I think what's most popular besides lifted trucks out here are the ones, is the speed trucks. Like most people have single cab trucks. Some people just have crew, uh, super cab. But single cab trucks, uh, it's a little fixed up, souped up or whatever. Um, and they drop it. I don't know. I just couldn't just drop a truck to me, it, it, and I want to contradict myself on this, it just doesn't, it's not, how can you say it? I don't know. I, I just can't drop a truck and I can't adjust it. So if I would ever have a truck and it's dropped, it would have to be bagged. It has to be tough. Man, I can drive around with it like super low. Um, I just couldn't have a truck that just dropped and it stays like that. I just couldn't do it. I, I don't know why. I just couldn't do it. <sighs> Sorry, guys. The grind don't stop, though. Um, but, yeah, man. Uh, I'm excited about this lifted truck, man. Lifting the truck. Now, this is, like, totally out of my element. This is... I never had a... I never owned a truck one. And... All this stuff I'm doing, guys, is new to me, so I'm learning. Uh, I'm going to make some costly mistakes, but I'm going to try not to. Um, yeah, man, but I'm excited, though, man. It's something different for me, my family, and then even the channel. Now, I wasn't even going to do this build on the channel. This wasn't supposed to be. I didn't buy the truck to build it on the channel. I actually just wanted a truck, and I had an opportunity to get one. So, hey, might as well build it on the channel and try to get a tax write-off on it, <laughs> basically. But I'm changing a lot of stuff, guys. This truck, um, this build is going to be like almost can go to SEMA type of build. Like, it's not no, I'm just throwing a lift on there and driving around putting rims on it like this is going to be like a real deal holy field truck like i'm going literally all in on this truck like because i was originally going to just put a six inch lift on it and do some cosmetic stuff and call it a day but i'm like nah man i want to be different i want to go out out and kill the game on youtube with this truck because you really don't see a lot of trucks about to do what I'm going to do on YouTube. Uh, they just usually just throw lifts on their truck and throw rims on there and, that, and they call it a day. Like I'm doing the outside end, like actually my Dodge Charger. Um, so it's going to be interesting um, and it's all going to come in play. I got some exclusive stuff coming in, like that's not on no other Ford F-150 yet. Lifted anyways. So I just can't wait. Um, can't wait, can't wait, can't wait, can't wait. Um, the next couple videos, uh, I know I got a hundred likes on that one video when I was talking about the miles per gallon of gas, but I made that video way before I thought I was gonna get the truck lifted. So I might have, I'm still gonna do it though. I'm still gonna do a dyno. So what I might have to do, man, I might have to, um, I think I'm gonna still take it to the dyno, just take my factories 
and put the factories on the rear of the um, dyno machine and let them run the dyno like that. Uh, hopefully that doesn't mess up everything, but I'm still gonna do it. Uh, I don't know if I had 200 likes, so that video is not coming about uh, how much I pay. I don't think I have 200 likes. Let me see it. Let me double check real fast. I could double check really quick. And guys, and I don't, and I know it's been a decrease in me commenting back on my videos, man. It's because I get so many freaking comments. I get more comments than I usually get. And I be so busy, I try to comment on most of. But if it's negative, you know I'm not going to comment on it regardless. Um, this is really not safe what I'm doing. Alright, let's see how many likes I got. Oh, no, 169, so y'all don't get to know how much I pay for this truck, that truck. Uh, so, if you get me 300 likes on this video, which probably won't, <laughs> if you give me 300 likes, uh, I'll tell you how much I pay for the uh, boosted F-150. Other than that, guys, that's all I have for the video, man. Um, pray for Houston, guys. It's going to freaking flood again. I don't know when y'all going to see this video. But it's going to flood again, man. Um, I got to get back on my grind on this YouTube. Uh, this is my second video um, I made in like literally two, almost three weeks, guys. Because I made so many videos back to back to back. And I just didn't publish them all um, at one time. So, yeah. I need to get back on my grind. If you, oh, comment below. Tell me what y'all think I should do to the Charger next. And no, I'm not doing the Rip Supercharger. I'm leaving the car as is. But comment below. Tell me what y'all think I should do to the Charger next. I think I should leave it alone. I think it's done. It's over with. On to the next one. But comment below. I would like to hear what y'all say. This is Robbie to a bunch of guys. Peace.